Hello, it's Bailey and welcome back to my channel. Today I am bringing you my August TBR. I honestly can't believe that August is basically here, but I'm just going to share five things that I'm planning on getting to in the month. I have a huge stack of like other things, but I'm just going to name five. I don't think you want to hear 20 books and then me not get to them all. So this is what it is. <laughs> There are only a couple of things that I am participating in this month. The first day of the month will be the second half of a 24 and 48 hour readathon that starts on the 31st of August, but I will be participating in the Escape for 24 readathon hosted by Rylan. I will post her announcement link for that down below. And then starting the 2nd through the 15th, I will be participating in the Squash That Series Challenge hosted by me and Kayla. I will also link those announcement videos down below. But I did already post a TBR for Squash That Series, so I'm not including any of those, but that's like half my month. So then I'm only going to have a little bit of time at the end of the month to read the rest of, of the things on my TBR. So that's why I'm keeping this fairly simple short I guess and so for the first book I'm going to mention it is for the shelf this book club which is a book club I host and each month I pick somebody that is in the book club to um pick a book for the club and then we host a live show in August it is being hosted by Nessa from Books with Nessa and the book is The Lost Causes by Ashley Embry Schwartz and Jennifer Cousset Edding I believe that's the correct author names I tend to mess it up but I will post uh, the cover of it here. The live show for this will be on my channel. Nessa is on like a little bit of a hiatus so it'll be here on my channel but we have not set a date for that yet so keep a lookout on Twitter or if you are part of the discord group we'll also post there when we have decided the live show date and time. So after that I'm hoping to get to a couple things that have been on my TBR for a while. I had a list of everything I owned before 2021 started and I wanted to get through that list by the end of the year. Not sure if that's going to happen but both of these books were things I owned before the year of 2021. So I'm hoping to get to Autobiography by Christina Lauren. This would be my first Christina Lauren book and I believe this is YA and most of their stuff is adult. Other than that I really don't know much of what this is about. Then a hit or miss author for me that I keep giving a chance to I'm going to try to get to the end of her by Sherry Lapina. My stepmom does also read Sherry Lapina so I feel like I have not like forwardly been acquiring her stuff but my stepmom will read it and then like ask me if I want it so I take them. So I'm still reading through her stuff and I know that her books are fairly, usually fairly easy to get through. Then since I read Firefly Lane by Kristen Hanna in the month of July, I am hoping to get to The Four Winds by Kristen Hanna. I do think that this one is a little bit more historical than Firefly Lane was and this is also her most recent release. And then to get a romance on the table, I am hoping to get to People We Meet on Vacation by Emily Henry. The longer this has been out, honestly the better things I keep seeing. I thought that beach read was okay and like good enough that I'm willing to give her another try. I'm hoping this one I will enjoy a little bit more than that. But there's that. Those are some things I'm planning on getting to in the month of August. Let me know down below if you're participating in anything. Actually let me know um, a series you are hoping to continue in the month of August since I will be hosting the Squash That Series Challenge. Um, again, check the description down below for all of the things I'm participating in, links and stuff, and I will see you again very soon. Bye!